these folks knew they were visiting New York, but many got more than they bargained for with a taste of Japan. I came by yesterday and it looked really amazing and thought it'd be a good idea to come back. Japan Week marked its fourth year at Grand Central Terminal, treating commuters to fashion and food from afar. One of the main draws, takoyaki, a street snack made of octopus and fried dough. When you make takoyaki, you have to roll around the dumpling, so uh, you need some kind of technique. And uh, in order to uh, do it uh, the, in a fast speed, you have to practice a lot. So, um, But these people are the champions of takoyaki making, so they are one of the best people in Japan. Mm. Good. It's very... It has to, you can taste everything. Ginger. Let's see. It's soft though. You get the, you, you feel the texture of the octopus and then it's obviously doughy. I think it was a little more doughy than I thought. Others went head over heels for a pair of shoes without them. Heelless, very high shoes that were designed by Noritaka Tatehana. And uh, he has created several pairs of shoes for Lady Gaga. And people look at the, the height of the shoes, which they're 12 inches, the ones in the display case are 18 inches high, and they say, oh, there's no way I'm, I'm going to be able to walk in them because they're, they're too high. But we have had a pregnant lady try them on, we've had men try them on, a seven-year-old kid try them on. Organizers say U.S. tourism in Japan is at an all-time high, drawing almost 900,000 visitors last year. And now is the time to travel because the value of yen is a little bit weaker than before, so this is really a good time to visit Japan. Jennifer Rizzi, New York Daily News.